Ciao friends, time for cupcakes! Ciao everyone, it's Beth at Thimblehooks and I went to Joann's. They were having a huge cupcake sale. It was amazing. These are $8 a piece. They were on sale for $2.99 and they had another coupon for 20% off more because I love my coupons. And I bought a whole bunch of stuff I didn't need, but it's going to be so much fun because I have two projects in mine already just by having all of this new yarn. So let's go through and see what I got. I think we bought almost everything that they had. I have this one is Sandcastle. I just love these colors. It's very oceany here and then there's some green on the outside but it's kind of the teal greens. I got four of these. I'm so excited. One, two, three, four. Yay! So what I ended up going for was to pick up two things. Those will be last. Everything else was not necessary got and gelato I couldn't resist just because of the name and look at that it looks like ice cream it just looks like it's all pastels this is going to be so cute I don't know what I'm going to do with this one yet but it will have a really fun end project because I really love the mandala products and this is so similar that I think I'm going to love it just as well I've never used cupcake before but I'm going to use a lot of it now so here's cupcake gelato and these are all a lightweight three they don't seem like they're quite that light, but I'll go with that. They're just like mandala. So we go. One, two, three, four of those. I figure four is a good amount for a project, even though my rule is I just buy one of something. I couldn't resist that price. So here we go. Couldn't resist the pricing. And this one was just too much fun. Apple picking. That was the perfect name for apple picking. Those are great colors. They're so fall. It's so, so autumn-y and so cute. Again, cupcake. 590 yards. I have three of them. I can do a lot of damage with that. This is going to be great. This will be awesome. But these are perfect. Perfect colors for fall. And I, Wouldn't it be fun to be the person that names yarn colors? It would be like the person who names paint. What a great job. That would be so fun. But apple picking is perfect. I got three of those. What's this one? Oh, beach ball. <laughs> it's funny. It's called beach ball. It totally does look like a beach ball. It looks like, this one looks like summer. Just like apple picking looked like autumn, this looks like summer to me. I have. I was able to take all of them that they had. They only had four left. I took them all. So again, yay. I was so excited. So many cupcakes. The huge, oh, wait a minute. Oh, oh here we go. And my next, my next surprise is, what is this one? Pot of Gold. Oh, that's a cute name too. That was great colors. Pot of Gold. Pot of Gold. Kind of looks like a pot of gold. Not nearly as much gold as one would think would be in Pot of Gold. But it does have a lot of really bright greens and blues to go with the little bit of gold splash that's in there. So this is awesome. Four of those. I'm so lucky to figure out a place to put these now, which would be funny. And this cupcake is Street Lights. I really like this one. I wish they had so much more of this one, but they didn't. They were almost out. See that? All those great colors in there. The teal and the gold and the or the yellows and the silver. They just, those are perfect color matches. It's going to be really nice. Very subtle transitions and it's really, really, these are really going to be pretty. I love it. And they were having a huge sale on Cupcake and Mandala and I happened to have a coupon and I just happened to be going by. So I stopped and I ended up with two garbage bags because they couldn't fit all the stuff that I got in normal bags. So they sent me out with their huge clear garbage bags. I think that's just hilarious. This one is one that I already have a huge project in mind. 
but I can't tell you what it is. I'll show you when I'm do when I'm done with it. Can't tell you what it is right now because it's a present. Shh, can't tell until it's done because the, then they will know what I'm making and that won't be much of a surprise. But this one is just gorgeous. This is mint chip. It has grays and kind of a cocoa color and a very light like a mossy kind of green in there. This is perfect. I think I ended up with nine of these making a huge project present but we won't tell anybody. I have nine of those. I got this for extra fun to go with it as a side project. So again, can't tell you what it is, but I'll show you later. But yeah, I got nine of these. Bought out the whole store. We looked on every shelf to see if I could come up with any more. So I have every single one of these in the mint chip, which is beautiful. Again, just gorgeous. I love them. And then now we're under the mandala that I actually, this is why I went to the store. Just these two things. This is why I went because they were on sale and I need two more to finish a big project that I'm working on. I underestimated my yardage. So I went to go and get these. This is Sparkle. I think it's Hercules. Yep, it's Hercules. It's the sparkly kind. It has this little flex of gold or silver in through the whole thing. It's just a big rainbow color. I'm almost done with that project, so that's going to be some com coming very soon. But I needed two more, otherwise I would have been, it would not have been done, and it would have looked really goofy. And you'll understand what I mean when you see it. And more mandala. I got four of the tweed stripes. I've never worked with these before. These are, these are a four, so these are way heavier. This is going to be like your typical Simply Soft or Red Heart with Love. So it's a little thicker than normal mandala. I've never used the tweeds, but these colors were just amazing. And all four of these, right here, all four of these say they're knock on wood as the color, but I think they look so much different. I'm really interested to see what kind of a pattern these are going to come up with when I start to crochet with them. So could be really fun. I really don't know what's going to happen. There's a lot of, a lot of different colors in there. Like in here, there's purple in this one, but there's barely any purple in this one, so it's kind of fun. I'm going to see what's going on with that. And then three of these, oopsie, three of these ones. My husband picked these out. He thought cat's eye. This is cat's eye. He thought these colors looked great. They're kind of bluesy and some coral colors and these kind of look the same. But he picked these ones out so I'll make something fun. Always do. And it's hard to go wrong with anything Lion Brand. I love their stuff. And these are super soft. I wouldn't have thought that the tweed stuff was going to be this soft, but it really, really is. It's very nice. But these are four instead of a three, so I have to use a five and a half millimeter. So that's okay. I can do that. This will uh, crochet up a little bit faster that way too, I guess, than I normally do. And this is the other thing that I actually went for. Kind of boring. Just some white. Karen Simply Soft. But those are the two. Those are the four things that I actually went to the store for. Two of these and two Mandala Hercules. And I came back with the rest of this crap. <laughs> came back with all the rest of this stuff that I probably don't need. Now I have to find a place to put it. Um, and now I have, I think this is the last one. Aw, how sad. I think this is the last one. This is my last grouping. That's so sad. But this is more mandala. This one is called Harpy. Oh, that's funny. But it's just a bunch of blacks and grays and a almost white, barely not white. It's like a winter white. At four of those, I had a project in mind already for this one. It's going to be very fun. So I wasn't going to buy these, but I did. And then I came up with a project in my head. So I said, yes, I'm going to buy them. So I have things ready to go in my head. Mint chip is going to be first. And as I work on that, it'll be several pieces to that project. So as I work on that, I will post each one. But again, can't tell you who it's for because they might see 
my video and go, oh, that's cool. I'm going to get that someday. Get that for Christmas. I don't want anybody to know. So I have to be a little bit sneaky at this time of year. And then for extra fun, my daughter will be going back to school. The they're not they're not going to have the online school anymore. Hopefully, she'll be going back at in the, like another week. Got her three little face masks. This one is a lion. I'm not going to open them, so these are going to be for her. So keep them keep them all clean and nice. But this one has a tiger face on it, which is going to be too funny. I wear that around school. I think that's hilarious. This one looks like a because oh, this looks like a Day of the Dead mask. Oh, that's funny. Well, that'll be perfect for the Halloween season. And this one looks kind of like Starry Night. Doesn't have as much of the golds in it, but the colors colors were just fun. Yeah, so those are super cute. Those are for her. She doesn't even know we have them yet because they've been at the bottom of my yarn bag. But it looks like that's everything. Oh darn, I'm all out. Oh, I'm all out. I guess I'll have to go to the store again. But Joanne's was having that huge cupcake sale. And Mandala was half price, but cupcake was even better. $8 down to $2.99. These were all half price. So I ended up on my receipt and it said I ended up saying saving over $250. So I think that's really neat. Plus an extra 20% off coupon and everything in this everything in these bags counted except for this one thing that was considered a doorbuster, my Burnett blanket, one that I had to get for a tiny project. That was the only thing that wasn't a doorbuster, or that was a doorbuster. So the only thing that wasn't concluded on my 20% off coupon. Oh, that's so funny. I was so, I was just laughing at one lonely thing that I really didn't need it right there, but I was at the store, so I got it. So I got it, so I'm ready for next time. But that was my giant cupcake and mandala haul. Gotta love it. It was too much fun. I love going to the store. Because like I said before, like I have said before, Ordering things online is fun, but sometimes I just want to go to the store and see what they have. And I hate being cooped up all the time, so we went to the store. And now I have a bunch of Christmas slash birthday slash baby pro projects that I could be working on. So, yay! I will have them all posted as I do them, so everyone can follow along, and it will be really fun. So I'm going to put all these... I'm going to have to go, I'm going to spend the rest of the day trying to find a place to put these right now because you can see my shelves are full, my other shelves are full, I don't know what I'm going to do. But that's what happens when they give me a 20% uh, off coupon and everything's already on sale. I'm buying it anyway, even if I have to keep it in my garbage bags. But there we go. Thanks for stopping by. And there we go. That was my whole, my uh, big big haul of cupcake and mandala lion brand stuff that I did not need except for the two pieces that I showed you and then the two carrots and blue softs everything else is extra but there was such a good price I had to go I had to go I just had to go to the store and hug my yarn so if you hug, hug your yarn today please do um, thanks for stopping by thank you for supporting my channel and please subscribe have a great day see you next time bye I don't know if that was any good